Alright guys, welcome back to episode, what is this, 8 now? Chapter 4, part 1. Looks like we're Rosella. Oh goodness! Whatever shall we do? What a whimsical place. Thank you, kind sir. This must be Oogie Boogie or Ooga Booga or whatever they call it. <laughs> Alright, just, you know, take your time. I don't have shit to do, like, you know, get out of this crazy fucking world. Okay. Nuts! What? This is going to take forever. I can't stand this rotten, worthless little shovel. Look at that pathetic. This is enough dirt to suffocate a bug. Oh. Um. Nuts! Hmm. Nobody will be using that elevator again. Look at her prance. Good fellow. Uh, thank you again. I wonder... Um, why does he take so long to see? He was... Here. Okay, lady. I got your link. I can't start digging your grave until tomorrow, though. Sorry. Not exactly. I don't need a grave just yet. Thanks to you, just sir. Just yet. Could you tell me if this is the land... Oops, I didn't mean to skip it. Land of Oogaboo is probably what she asked. And he has to get out again just to talk to us instead of... Turning... What is he doing? This here is a fully automatic, steam-driven, rat-powered, grave-digging machine. I made it myself. Those rotten kids broke in, and they stole me power source. They took my rat. And quest acquired. Side quest acquired. Main quest, whatever. <sighs> Everything's a main quest. Jeepus. Hmm. That looks like something we'll probably have to remember yet. Er. Later. A uh, skull bat spider. Sure. I'll remember it. Skull bat spider. There it is again. They really what was that music? <laughs> it's like someone just slammed their face into a freaking synthesizer keyboard. Okay. Nice doggy. <laughs> A werewolf named Thaddeus Scabies tried to steal a poor farmer's three babies. As he crept through the house, he was nipped by a mouse who was mad, and the wolf died of rabies. What a cute Marjorie, little rhyme. fragile and pale, always wore a voluminous veil. When her yards of black crepe caught the wind like a cape, poor Margie blew off in the gale. Hello, lady. Whoa, what's going on? Are you all right, ma'am? Can I help you? No one can help me! Okay. Ah, ah, ah! 
Um... Yikes! I guess some people just like to be left alone. <laughs> All right. A paranoid fellow named Ed. Oops, I keep skipping things accidentally. The debonair Archduke von Drake was uh -oh. always a bit of a... <laughs> Better get out of here. I don't think that's a good thing. Oof. She just like casually walks past him like, Bitch, you don't scare me. I don't know what that is. We're not going to worry about it right now. Kitty! That's because it's our grave. Get in there. I can't believe I did that. My mother taught me to have better sense. <laughs> She's like, dang it, I'm such a dumbass. The daredevil Morgan Wegg smoked his pipe on a gunpowder keg. Boat they 20. found his head on the bridge and his arm near the ridge, but no one could find his left leg. What a cute little rhyme. Here's the body of Benjamin Crabby, who in life was incredibly grabby. Don't stand on his grave, for his corpse can't behave. Old Benji might pop up and nab ye. Well, y'all know what I'm about to do next, right? <laughs> Just can't resist hmm. it. I guess I should have read the headstone more carefully. Get out of here. <laughs> Whoa, what? That guy is bad news. Next time, I'm not waiting to find out just how bad. He just shows up randomly. It's not like... It's not like this game really penalizes you for dying, so it's just kind of like whatever. <laughs> I'll try to hope I don't get it next time. There's something about this branch, like, um... I forget, I think somebody in here tells you, like, somebody in the game tells you about, like, if the branch is pointing up something, if the branch is pointing down something else, I, I don't remember. Sounds to like that. Oh, meddlesome kids. You stop that. You little fiend. Get out of here. Really worked himself up for that. That wasn't that scary. Come on. Wow. Dr. Mort Cadaver. Ha! Huh. Now there's a name to inspire confidence. <laughs> huh. I'm so funny. Yes? May I help you? Mm, hello. Uh, I am Rosella of Daventry. Uh, m may I ask you a few questions? Certainly, Miss Rosella. Do come in. Quickly, please. I think when I was younger and I played this, the, oog or the boogeyman or whatever he is creeped me out. I was like, oh man, I hope one will run. Oh man, it's so scary. Young children are funny. Welcome to Ooga Booga, Miss Rosella. I am Dr. Mort Cadaver. 
Purana, how may I help you? I'm seeking King Otark, ruler of the trolls. I've heard that he's been detained in this land. Have you heard anything about him? No, but I bet that wicked Malaysia is behind it, since she caused the destruction of our beloved ruler, Count Tepish. This land has slipped into chaos. The boogeyman thinks he owns the place, and those horrid kids have run amok. I'm afraid to go outside anymore. If they're just kids, can't you do something to stop them? I'm just the town doctor. I spend a great deal of time replacing limbs, reattaching noses, you know. But I could hold my own against those kids. Until last week, that is, uh, when I gave my spine away to a charming lady who'd fallen off a cliff. Oops. It seems that without a backbone, I can't stand up to anyone. <sighs> How clever oh, well, and funny. Uh, excuse me, my dear. I must fill out some death certificates now. Cool. That's mm, quite a nice coffin. What do you use it for? Oops. I think I skipped again. Oh well, I doubt we're missing anything important. Leg of Lizard, Eye of Newt, Toxic Toadstool Powder, Modisonium Glutamate, yikes! That was another funny joke, guys. What the heck? What is he doing? <gasps> What's wrong with him? Oh, Mr. Nibbler here is in for an attitude adjustment. Hey, lady. Got any fava beans? What's that mean? Closer, Rosella. Closer. How do you know my name? Dr. Cadaver? You really should have a spine. Can you get yours back? Oh, I couldn't. The patient must come first. But, Miss Rosella, I'd do anything for another one. I tried a broomstick and some dried spaghetti, but it just wasn't the same. Yeah, who could have thought that a broomstick and spaghetti wouldn't be like a spinal column? I mean, geez, that's insane that that didn't work. Like, she really dust his place. I mean, seriously. Have a little more pride. Oh no, not that music. Yeah, we gotta wait till they're not in there. almost done exploring, I think. I don't think they're in there. Let's see what we can find. I suppose a girl never knows when she'll need a foot in a bag, especially in Ooga Booga Land. Especially in a Sierra game. What a good idea.
I'm never giving one of those things to my children. Never, ever, ever. You're never gonna have children. I don't think there's anything else really to look at in here, maybe. <laughs> Eek! Eek! This is what I say when I am afraid. And then Hi, guys. Hi! <laughs> Eek! Eek! Jesus. Don't tell on me, okay? I was never here. Uh-oh, we can't be here yet. Yeah, we definitely can't be here yet. See you later. Oh no, you missed. Another one. What was that? A tomato or well. I like how she wasn't even squeamish about just like taking a amputated foot and a spinal column just chilling on the ground. Do come in, Miss Rosella. Because who needs to be scared of that? It's not gross at all. He's like, check out my butt. And she's like, no, thank you. Excuse me, Miss Rosella. I'll be right with you. Oh, now those are then, some Mr. Intense Bugbear, eyebrows on Rosella over there. That broken heart of yours. Let me just rub my chin in it. There we go. No big deal. Did he put the stapler gun in him too? Oh, thank you, Dr. Cadaver. Oh, cookie monster. Ew. Why is he so squishy when he runs? What can I do for you, Miss Rosella? You can suck my dick, cause look at what I brought you. Wait, look at what I brought you is what I was trying to say and then my sentence failed because I can't English sometimes. Dr. Cadaver, I have a surprise for you. Don't ever do that again. I'll fucking kill you. Oh, I am eternally grateful to you. I would like to repay you in some small way. Okay. <laughs> ah. Here, just what every young lady needs. A dear little pet to keep her company. I made him myself. Hmm. Uh, thank you, Dr. Cadaver. <laughs> Apparently it wasn't a good looking pet. That's all we'll do here. Closer, Rosella. Closer. That's what you said last time. You're boring. I'm sick of your shit.
map layout doesn't make a whole lot of sense. Please tell me they're there. No, they're not there. Where the fuck are they? Oh yeah, this is where this is, okay. I forgot. Oh no, I didn't even expect that a second time. What? Oh, too slow. Not again. <laughs> well, shoot. I think we're going to stop here. Next time, oh dang. We still have a while to go. Next time, we'll see if we can figure out what we're supposed to be doing with a foot and a weird pet. Because I don't really know what that puzzle is yet. <laughs> I can't figure it out. Hope you guys have enjoyed this episode, and I will see you guys next time. Bye!